Okay, so here is the Diamond Select Silver Centurion Iron Man. Came out a few years ago. I got it from Amazon for basically, I got a gift card, so I decided to get it. Um, I'm glad I didn't really pay for this figure. Aesthetically, it's one of those that look really good. But, oh my goodness, this could be one of the worst constructed figures ever. Okay, where do I begin? So, the leg broke off. I had to glue it back on. The joints are super stiff. You could barely even bend the elbows and do, like, super articulation with it. Again, Diamond Select, I, you know what? You dropped the ball on this figure. This figure looks good. It looks, it should have been a statue. That's what it was, okay? This is, a, like, a statue, you can, the, the the stand that comes with it can barely even hold them up. I don't even know how I was able to get this done. It took me forever. I Like, this was the most frustrating film shoot I've ever done. Um, like, you're looking at it, you're like, wow, that looks really good. And it does look good. But it sucks. The articulation on this figure is one of the worst ones. I, I'll be honest with you. The reaction figures that Super 7 do have better articulation than this guy. It's, it is really bad like they give all these cool accessories it looks good like even tony stark's head like it's okay but his left eye is like it's like it's like going towards it's not you know straight on it's they just didn't quality control this properly but anyway uh look i'm gonna be honest with you i would not recommend this figure go with the mesco one which i've ordered of course and i wouldn't pay money for this guys i'll, I'll be honest with you right um, if you just want to get it to have it, just to put it on a simple pose and make it look good, great, go for it. But don't pay a lot of money on it. Like, I would get this on clearance if you can, like $10, $15, if you can ever see this at a flea market or if you have an Amazon gift card, something, I would not pay um, a lot of money on it. I didn't even bother doing the optical cyber um, Iron Man uh, third mask that it comes with. Because it's just, it was useless. Anyway, there's the back of it. The jetpack comes off as well. But again, the paint chips so easily off this figure. It, it is, quality control wise, I don't know who did this at Diamond Select. But man, I tell you right now, if they're still employed, Diamond Select, you better look at this carefully. Because um, it looks, it, aesthetically, they went for looks. But it, overall, the the figure fails on a, on a, on many fronts. I'll, I'll give it a five out of ten. Barely passed because it looks cool. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Be sure to hit that like button, drop a comment, and see you next video.